Hello and welcome to this little bonus episode of Arctic Knitting. Uh, today I thought that I was going to show you how I finished this kofta. It is sticked. It is made in alpaca. And I love it. I am very very much fond of knitting kuftas and especially garments that you have to stick. I love knitting them in rustic wools so where you don't have to sew. This however I have sticked using a sewing machine and it it works. I don't think it looked bad at all even though alpaca is a slippery yarn and I thought I would bring you along on that process. This is by no means a tutorial. It's just me showing how I do it. I think I do a little bit of talking but mostly it will just be sticking to music. So I hope you enjoy and if you have any questions please put them down below and I will try to address them either in the comment thing or here on YouTube or I will take it up in a future podcast and if there's something that needs further explaining I will try to do that but I am not making tutorials because I don't have the equipment and I don't have the skills to do that. You see my sticks is done by making three pearls, one it and then three pearls and I have just sewn on the one side of the stick, see, I think you can see it here, I sewn on this side of the stick, I just use, I'm just using very very small stitches on my sewing machine, I'm just using this straight stitch, Someone, some prefer to use the Zigzag, a tiny zigzag stitch at first and then the straight stitch. I do the straight stitch twice and now I'm going to do the straight stitch twice on the other side of the of the knit stitch and then I'm going to cut in the middle of this. sides of the stick I think you're able to see there there's one seam or two seams going down here and two seams there and now I'm just going to cut right in the middle of those seams okay so you can see I'm going to cut right here in the middle of that stretch of that knit stitch in the middle of the stick This is the first time you're doing this. Just take it real slow and see that you don't cut anything outside of the actual stick. As you can see, I haven't sewn in the ends yet. I'm going to do that at the very end. And you can see on these edges that they are going to fray because it is the yarn is so slippery so this would never have held up without those securing stitches so the next step that i'm going to take is to sew in the ends around the button band these ones these ones and these ones and then i'm going to take a little bit of ribbon and just sew on top of here just to hide this edge 